Well, it's raining this morning right now at uh, 8 o'clock in the morning, quarter of 8, actually quarter of 9, here in Rappahannock County. It's, uh, it's nice, but when you hear the noise you hear on the machine is the rain hitting the tin roof, so get over it. Now, what we're going to do is I hope you enjoyed the, the, uh, the slide stuff. That was a that was a, a lot a whole lot of it that we, we recorded her and um, hopefully I passed it on and went well. Keep at it. You want what you want to do is you want to look at it a lot, get a feel for it. That's the easiest way to do it. And then just you know play the slide. Just let the thing go. You'll 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 tell you, you'll know when it's right. That's all there is. It's, it's not it's not a mystery. Believe me. Remember the rules. Twelfth twelfth position is the open right. Four up from that, four, the fourth, five, seven up, 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 five frets, seven frets is the fifth, and so on. Just the, the simple, the simple little rules that, that always pay off. Now that was an open G tuning, right? D, G, D, G. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take the B and take it up to C. And that's a famous banjo tuning called Mountain Minor. Some some bullshit. I can't I can't I can't remember the name of it right now. It doesn't matter. But it's 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 used in, in sort of modal. <laughs> Stuff like that. Uh, it's a great it's a great tuning. Because what it is, is it's dad gad only in G and pushed more more toward the treble. Dad gad, remember the, the third string is the fourth of the key, right? In this tuning the second string is now the fourth of the key. So that means that I've got all this stuff. Listen, listen to the four. Hear that? That note, that C, is the fourth in the key of G. That's, that's very, very interesting. It's, uh, it means that you have this, just like Dad did, you have a working suspension with the open strings. Like this. When you strike a huge harmonic, To, to the fifth, bringing it up to D. It's the same thing as doing in, 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 in Dad Gad. Bringing the G up to the A, it's the same thing. But the effect it has, because, because everything is different in open G tuning as, as opposed to Dad Gad. It's, just, it's very different. thing about this tuning when you when you play around with it is you'll notice that all the, the shapes one and three on the next string are the same note this gives you the possibility of playing roll like things like years ago I recorded uh, uh, Alice and I did an album called Lord Ronan's Return and it was based on a banjo piece which I which I wrote called Lord Ronan's Return it was about one of our poodles that same note at the fifth fret I'm playing this note G and G on the, on the second string as well now if I had the same note like that me that means I can do this It's like a, uh, a, a tremolo, only not. If I really want to make it like a tremolo, and this is what I did in Lord Ronan's Return, is I, the thumb comes. Thumb, 
index middle, same note, right? But then the thumb drops down to the second string to that, that, that pedal tone, that G pedal tone. first string too, so, so I C, C, D, if I want to keep the scale going, G, A, B flat, C, D, like that instead, so you have only one note on, on, on the second string. So. G, A, B flat, C, D, up, D, on the first string, or on the second string, if you want the first string to ring, ring free. When you fool around with this,